Hey everybody, welcome to this week's midweek message. Hope everybody's having a great week. Um, didn't get a chance to write a blog this week. Had a busy weekend, a lot going on, and just didn't didn't have time to sit down and write anything. But uh, I was I was watching some TikToks the other night. Yes, TikToks, uh, TikTok, and and other social media avenues. They can be really po a positive thing. They it, it just depends on the things that you follow and the things that you watch and and the people that you follow on there, um, whether it's a positive or a negative and on TikTok, I follow some Christian people that they do some um, devotionals and different things like that. And I was I was watching this one the other day, and this guy, this, this was really powerful to me. He was talking about chasing the person that God created you to be, and, and striving and making that his passion every day to become that person that God created him to be. And and he used the illustration. You know, he talked about how. You know, everybody, every Christian, when they they meet God, their desire is to hear those words, well done, thy good and faithful servant. And he also used the illustration, what if when we meet God, we meet that person face to face that he created us to be? And that really made me think about my own life. And, and you know, I spent years running away from that person that God created me, me to be. I spent years shying away from that person for, for a number of reasons, I guess. Um, and, and I've talked, I've told my story and talked about this on my blog when I first started it. And it's too long to, to talk about, you know, the whole thing on here, but, um, you know, I, I, I spent a long time, um, running away from that. And you hear, you hear testimonies and stories all the time. And it's, it's really awesome when, um, that, that, that switch flips and all of a sudden you take that different path in your Christian life and, and your, your Christian walk becomes a lot closer to God and you hit another level in your Christian life and, and you start really heading down the road that leads to being that person that God wants you to be. And so as I thought about that and I thought about, uh, my own life, you know, the thing I thought about was what if when we meet God, and we meet that person face to face. What if that happens and we meet that person face to face? Are we going to be identical twins with that person? Or are we going to recognize that person but not look exactly like them? Or is that person going to be a complete stranger? And that, that really, you know, that really spoke to me and that really um, made me think about um, I, I don't want to be a stranger to that person and I don't want to be. Um, I don't, I don't want to, you know, kind of resemble or recognize that person. I want to be identical twins with the person that God created me to be and the, the person that God wants me to be and, and to become. And so, you know, my question for you this week is, you know, where are you at with that? You know, I, I asked myself that um, as I was watching that the other day. And, uh, you know, if if we're on the right path and we're going down that right road, then keep on going and, and strive every day to chase that person. And if, if we're not there, then we need to find, you know, what, what route we need to take and what changes we need to make to get to that. And, and so I, I just, you know, I challenge everybody to, you know, do a little self-reflection, check and see where you're at and think about if that was to happen, if we were to meet that person face to face, when we meet God, are, are we going to, are we going to have reached our full potential as a person and as a Christian and be identical twins with that person, or are they going to be a stranger or somewhere in between? So, um, just just my my thoughts for the week. Um, like I said, uh, you know it, that that really spoke to me when I was watching that. But uh, I challenge everybody, you know, to examine yourself and and see where you fall um, when it comes to being that person that God created you to be. So, hope everybody has a great rest of your week. And remember, love God, love people, go make a difference.